We have a great, great speaker coming up next. I'm so excited about hearing David. David Edward Garcia is an author, he's a comedian, he's a motivational speaker, and he is a linguist who speaks five languages. I speak two languages, English and Southern. He was both the number one youth motivational comedian by the top youth speaker of the USA. Please put your hands together and welcome David Edward Garcia. I'm excited to be here with you all today. Uh, my name is David Edward Garcia. I can present in English. Uh, I can do this in Spanish, but also in Espanol. I can present in French. Uh, I can do this in Portuguese. I almost fala brasileiro. I live in Italy. Uh, anche parlo italiano. Do I hear a little bit of Italian? <laughs> Se vuoi ascoltare posso dire molte cose, mi piace moltissima la lingua, è qualcosa bella, grazie. No. 
wrong is he said, the reason is because you don't live with your biological father. And I was like, sir, my dad is not a scientist. I didn't know what a biological father was. I was like, he's not a biological father, he's a Mexican father. Right, so this is what I went through. Uh, but right after high school, like, right when I entered college, I found, like, my career and my calling. Uh, and I went to Paris, France for the first time and did a class trip. And I fell in love with the language, uh, with the food, uh, with the ladies. And, uh, and I remember it hit me, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to learn, like, different languages and go around the world and help other kids that are going through what I'm going through. So I told the people there, I said, I'm going to learn French one day and I'm going to come back. They like got offended. They're like, oh, no, 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 no. Cristiano Garcia. <laughs> and they have this joke in Europe. They said, David, if you speak three languages, you're trilingual. If you speak two languages, you're. They said, David, if you speak one language, what are you? And I said, you're monolingual. No, you're a mad cat. <laughs> and so I went back to my neighborhood and I was like, maybe the dudes back in my neighborhood will support me. So I said, guys, you know, I'm going to go to college, I'm going to learn languages, I'm going to travel all over the world helping kids. And the guys in my neighborhood, they all looked at me and they all said, <laughs> Now for those of y'all that are not fluent in Mexican, <laughs> means dream on. Right? You're a beautiful girl, really? <laughs> David, I am so proud to be your dad. Really, dad? <laughs> I've been able to break it down into three keys uh, on how to overcome any obstacle, how to find your happiness, how to find success, and how to find your life calling. I'm going to actually teach on it tomorrow uh, in the educational session at Richmond Room 3 at 9 a.m. You can come, or you can get my book for free, DavidEdwardGarcia.com. This is what my whole uh, speech is all about. So I don't have time to go into it, but to make the story short, uh, I was able to graduate high school, college, uh, with a bachelor's and a master's, I was able to learn five languages. And just a few years ago, uh, they invited me to Switzerland to the largest conference for young adults and teens. Uh, over 2,500 people, and they wanted me to give three out of four speeches, all in French. And I was able to flip the script on them, and I used the same joke that they had told me over 10 years before. And I took the mic, and I looked at them, and I said, If you speak three languages, you're trilingual. If you speak two languages, you're bagging with. But if you speak five languages, you're David Edward Garcia. <laughs> See, when you're motivated, you can flip the script. See, I used to get in trouble when I was a kid for saying jokes and saying stories, and I used to get paddled. Huh? And now they're flying me all over the world saying, David, tell us your jokes, tell us your stories. I used to get punished. Now I get paid! I mean, I want to help you to find the same solution so you can get paid when you're following your passion, you're living your best life now, you're being fully happy and engaged in life. See, when you find your motivation, you become unstoppable. Uh, the one who taught me this uh, probably best is uh, my dog back home. We have a Doberman. And, and a Doberman looks like a miniature horse. I mean, this dog is muscular. He's ripped. When I go in the morning to wake him up for a walk, he's already doing abs. He's like, what's up, David? You ready? <laughs> and so this Doberman, uh, his name is Rojo. And we call him Rojo because he's brown. <laughs> so one day I was taking Rojo for a walk, right? And Rojo's a beast, man. He's the, like, like the guy said, he's a sexy beast, man. Rojo is walking in the neighborhood, he's like, what's up, ladies? <laughs> and one day when Rojo was walking, Chihuahua came and got in his face. Now, if you don't know what a Chihuahua is, just put a toy poodle and a Mexican rat into one, and that's a Chihuahua. Right? And so this rat came and got in Rojo's face. And this rat was like trembling. He's like, started running laps around Rojo. So Rojo, Rojo was perplexed. He stopped and he looked at this Chihuahua. And then he looked at me. And I was like, Rojo, I've only seen this on a Taco Bell commercial. I don't know what's going on. So he looks at the Chihuahua again. And then he looks at me. And then he confuses all of us. He looks at the dog and he goes, And then he takes three muscular pronounced steps. Boom, boom, boom. 
he proceeds to lift up his leg like this. <laughs> I'm not going to finish the story, but let's just say that that day the Chihuahua received an abundance of blessing. <laughs> Conference. I'm from Laredo, Texas. My name is David Edward Garcia. I hope to see you at my birthday. God bless you. Man.